Oh, hello everyone. It is your favorite Saiyan Prince, Prince Vegeta, today. I'll be playing more Would You Rather, and I have another guest on the channel. Oh yes, say hello, Love Fishy. <laughs> Just a massive smile on my face right now. <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing today? Oh, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Good to hear. It's good to hear. Assuming you've played Would You Rather before. Yes, I have. I have played Would You Rather before. Okay, then. For warning, the, the questions on this site can be kind of a little bit out there. I'll just say that. I'll say that. What do you mean by out there? Oh, they, like, they, they can be out there. That's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to let you in on. More fun <laughs> when you get surprised. <laughs> okay. We can start whenever. It's... Well, this is an interesting question. Would you rather live in constant fear of being assassinated or have a traumatic injury in your adult life and it takes five years to recover? A lot of time to recover. I don't like that. I'd probably take the time to recover. That paranoia would get to me. Yeah, it's understandable. It's understandable, but five years? I, I can't do it. Too long. This is this is one of those where I need more information. Like, am I for sure gonna get assassinated? Is this like a top tier? Like somebody who's like getting paid like a lot of money, they're good at their job, and they're for sure gonna kill me at some point? Or is this like like one of those just like dark <clears throat> web, I really wanna kill this person? Like three thousand dollars, here you go. I mean, I, I don't know. I think regardless, I, I would still take that option. It never, it never states that I will get assassinated, it just says I'm in fear of it. Hmm. That paranoia would get to me, so I'm gonna go with the opposite answer. <laughs> Understandable. I, I think I'll take the fear of being assassinated. Five years is just too much recovery time for me. See what they say, though. 29% agree with me, 71% agree with you. Understandable, it was, ex it was expected. Oh, ooh. I had this question earlier with another friend of mine. Would you rather live through your biggest fear, or have to relive your biggest regret? Oh, no. I'd choose my biggest fear. Oh, nah. Nuh-uh. Mm -hmm. Nah. I... I don't even remember what I said last time. I think I said my biggest regret. I'm not sure. Why do you choose your biggest fear? What's wrong with the biggest regret? <laughs> Let's just say I regret this one thing in particular a lot. And it, it, it mm. makes me low-key cry myself to sleep at night. <laughs> really? Hmm. I, I'm gonna, mm. I don't, that's a, it's a good question. I think I'm gonna live to my biggest fear. I don't want, I don't want to have to relive anything. 42% mm. agree with us. Minority, of course. <laughs> Ooh, would you rather constantly hear a high-pitched sound? Or be unable to hear your voice when you speak. Unable to hear my speak. One hundred percent. Unfortunately, I can't choose that option. It's voice acting. I need to hear myself. Otherwise, I would choose that. I'm I'm gonna hear a high pitched sound, even though that is annoying. Very annoying. Eventually, it'll fade into the background. I'll take Eventually. it. Eventually. After like a week. Either that or you'll just go insane. Yeah, pretty much. 36% agree with me, 64% agree with you. Not bad, not bad. Ooh, okay, would you rather visit every state in your country or visit every country in the world? 
Hmm. I'll take every country in the world. Yeah, same, honestly. Yeah. I live in America. I don't really care for the other states. Like, they're fine and all, but, you know, it's America. They're, they're all right. They're all right. Not that bad, but still. 80% agree with us. Oh, that's the major majority right there. Oh, God. Oh, no. Why? Why? Okay, would you rather lick a pile of dog poop or lick the floor of a school bathroom? The floor of a school bathroom, my dude. I don't want to do either. I, I don't like this question. You gotta answer it. You gotta answer. Ugh. God. It's just, I can't, that's so, ugh. It didn't specify that it was a dirty bathroom floor, did it? Well, I guess that's true, I guess, I guess that is true. I, I'll take the floor then. Since they didn't specify. Wow, 82% agree with us. We got the majority on that. Yeah. Figured. For people to choose dog poop, they must have very nasty school floors. Gotta be. There's oh. no way you would choose that intentionally. That, uh, I, I mean, I've seen some pretty dirty bathrooms as a professional cleaner. Repulsive. Would you rather see one day into your own future? Or visit the afterlife one time in return. I think I'd say I'd see a day into my future. It's only one day. No, you know what? The, yeah, I don't know. I don't really care for the afterlife. I guess there's some people I'd want to talk to in the afterlife, but. I suppose. There are a few serial killers that I can sit down with them to get shot. So probably the after. Fascinating reasoning. I'd still choose to see a day into my future. I'd go into detail about the serial killers, but, you know, I, I, I can't. I see. 36% agree with me, 64% agree with you. <laughs> I have this question on stream, I believe. Would you rather have a mild case of COVID for the rest of your life, or have a heart attack several times a year? What was the first one again? Have a mild case of COVID for the rest of your life. I've never had COVID, so I, I don't know. I would take COVID easily. Probably COVID then. I'm gonna go with your answer because I don't know what COVID's like. I, I'm not gonna have multiple heart attacks a year. That sounds excruciating. Seventy-six percent agree with us. Yep. That's the only sensible answer there. COVID isn't really that bad. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Would you rather randomly time travel either ahead 20 years or behind 20 years every time you uh, pass gas? Interesting. Or teleport to a different place on Earth every time you sneeze? Every time I pass gas, bro. Every time I pass gas. I don't really sneeze that often, so I'm gonna go with the teleport whenever I sneeze. I'm not a very sneezy person. I I, I sneeze like five times in a row every single time, so no thank you. Normally when I sneeze, it's just like one huge sneeze and then I'm good. That'd be, it'd be terrible for you, though. Oh, it would be awful, dude. Quickest way to get motion sickness. 
see what we got. See what they said. 68% agree with us. Wow. Oh, with me. Why? Like, why? What is what is these people's obsession with poop? This is the second poop question. Would you rather lose the ability to pee or lose the ability to poop? Lose the ability to pee because I have to pee all the time, dude. It makes me It actually frustrates me how often I have to pee. I, I think I'm a, an, a, in agreement with that. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm in agreement with that. Cause you only, you only like, you only poop like, like once a day. Yeah. Like on a natural, you know, psych bodily cycle. So. Thirty-nine percent agreed with us, I believe. Can't believe we got the minority on that one. They, they're not thinking logically. You know, they're not thinking. They never do. Brain. That was what? Is, okay. I. Uh, would you rather marry an exact clone of yourself, or marry your brother slash sister? I'm marrying my clone. Yeah, my clone. Um... What is wrong with you people? Is there something literally wrong with you? Are you missing brain cells? I can't believe people in these ridiculous questions. <laughs> Only 76% agreed with us. What's wrong with you other 24%? They're from Alabama. We are the 76%. They're from Alabama. That's what it is. Gotta be. I would, Gotta be. I would marry me any day over marrying a sibling. I'm not doing it. Would you rather vomit every time you see the color brown... Or have to sneeze ten times whenever you are touched. The first one. I can't imagine sneezing ten times every time. I mean, it depends on what they mean by touched. Like, if someone touches my shirt, does that count? Because if not, then I'm just wearing full body clothes. And I'll go with that option. I don't know. I see the color brown way too much to choose the vomit option. So yeah, I I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with the sneezing one. Sixty-five percent agree with me. Interesting. I, I don't think it'd be that bad. You get you get lightheaded. And your nose would hurt, but then after that, you'd be fine. Ooh. Just me sneezing five times. I can't imagine sneezing ten times. Would you rather lose the ability to read or lose the ability to speak? Lose the ability to speak. 100%. Because I can learn sign language. I can learn sign language. I already know a little bit of sign language. That's easy. Oh, I forgot I'll sign learn. language was a thing. That's a good point. See, I'll lose my ability to speak. I literally forgot sign language was a thing. <laughs> I'll take it. 36% mm -hmm. agree with us. We are the main we're the minority again, yes, of course. They, they can't think on our level. What is wrong with you people and poop? I'm so done with this. I am literally done with this website. <laughs> Would you rather have to urinate on trees or poop on carpets? What, are, are you people animals? Are you dogs out in the wild? Oh my god. Do, do, do I... I don't know how, as a female, I would pee on a tree. I... Well... it's a good <laughs> question, actually. I don't know, maybe you'll have to get creative. You have to climb on top of it or something, I don't know. <laughs> Seems like a lot of extra work. I have a lot of questions in my head about this one, but they're not intending so I'm gonna keep them to myself. <laughs> I, oh, uh, I don't even... 
I was like urinating on a tree. I'm a guy, it's much easier. I'm pooping on a carpet. <laughs> I, I feel like this is a trick question for me because I physically can't pee on a tree. Uh, I'm stuck. That's what I am. I'm stuck. <laughs> well, you only have one option left then. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm going to fucking... I'm sorry. Well, let's see what they say. Wow. 88% agree with me. Understandable. I don't know who would want to poop on a carpet. Ugh, th these they're people are not, obsessed. They're not logical thinkers. They're not logical thinkers like I am. I, I think logically. How would I physically be on that tree? Be a whole lot of work. Be a whole lot of work. <laughs> would you <laughs> rather live alone for the rest of your life or live single with 10 kids? Uh, I'm gonna be alone for the rest of my life. I'm not gonna be single with I'm 10 kids. I'm not doing it. I'm still trying not to laugh from the previous question. <laughs> what they said, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> uh, I don't know. 10 kids seems like a lot. It seems like a lot of kids. Indeed. I'm going alone. I, I can be alone for the rest of my life. I don't care. I'm not doing ten kids. Mm. Way too many. Yeah, I I'll be alone for the rest of my life, man. Dude, like, I don't know. Too many. I, I already don't want kids. I already have trunks. I don't need more trunks. I, I can't do it. <laughs> be a nightmare. 64% agree with us. Look at that. Ooh. Would you rather be immune from all laws within your country or be the president of your country? I will be immune, immune from all, to laws. all laws. Exactly. Yeah, because the president, the president doesn't have as much power as people think that he does. He has to go through a bunch of, bunch of malarkey in order to pass a law. <laughs> A bunch of malarkey. <laughs> well, I'm oh, sitting here God. trying not to curse. Because I'm a natural, I'm a natural sailor. <laughs> I've never heard that as a censorship word ever in my life. A bunch of malarkey. Oh, that's great. Yes, I choose to be immune from all laws. That's the superior yeah. answer, obviously. I mean, yeah. Ooh, 70 they pick the other one. Yeah, if they pick the other one, they're not they're not right in the brain. They don't know what the president does. Or yeah. how he works. Being the president isn't really all that great. As far as I'm concerned. And we'll be hitting our final question, which is would you rather run five miles every day or do a thousand jumping jacks every day? Hmm. I think I might hit that 1,000 jumping jacks. The jumping jacks do seem easier. So yeah, I'm gonna go with jumping jacks. I was thinking real hard on that. Like, no, I hate exercise. Thinking extra hard. Let me see, see what they got. Wow, only 30% agree with us. I, I, I can't well, even. Then. Well then. I... <laughs> what that got... Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, that was our game. I, I, I don't know how to feel about that. Three of those questions just shouldn't have existed. <laughs> yeah, that was way too many questions to have, uh... Been about... Been about... Yeah. That, that I don't was... want to think about it. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about that either. But I hope you enjoyed yourself. Cause I, I, I did not. <laughs> that was some of those are kind of pain to answer. Yeah, <laughs> I had fun. I had fun. I did as well. Ooh, looks like my computer's gonna have an overload in a moment. So I gotta end this quickly. <laughs>
I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and subscribe. Comment down below anything you'd like to see me do in the future, and I'll try to get around to it. Go follow uh, Blubby on her Twitch. It'll be in the description below. And I don't know how many are you, but how many followers? Uh, I only have like 65, I think. Well, but, let's get it to like, 100. I'm getting a new mic. I'm getting, I'm getting a new mic, so I'm going to be sounding way better than I am. Like right now. Like I sound probably like trash, but... I mean, I'm not using a mic either. I'm using my earbuds. I haven't got my mic yet. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Everything is going wrong right now. Like I said, leave a like, subscribe, comment down below anything you'd like to see me do in the future. I'll try to get around to it. Go follow her on Twitch. And uh, hit the bell say notified. And I'll see you safely to the next one. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> If we try to come in 20 commit, you never went to the end of letting anybody damage our pride. Surpassing every limit, you know that we steady breaking. The saints walk in the party, you know we about to make a lit. Battle after battle, leaving all the haters quaking in the space force boots. Can't nobody stop the sages. Flying in with the dragon balls. We finna some machine raw unless a dragon call. Got the zinny and the babies, yeah, we got it all. Everybody better pipe down when the saints talk. Ah, saints talk.